Hello, hello. Welcome to my channel. I am very excited because I am going to be doing the FabFetFun Winter 2018 unboxing and I have a ton of add-ons in here as well. Um, I am a little bit worried. It, the package arrived um, wet on this side. So I'm hoping nothing is damaged. I am going to open it with you and we are going to discover whether or not anything is damaged together. I, I'm, I'm feeling fairly optimistic. I think it's going to be okay. Um, and I uh, a little bit of feedback on FabFitFun customer service. Last um, sale, the fall edit sale, I had a product that was empty. I had the box but there was no product in it. I emailed them and I said, you know, a, a credit on my account is absolutely fine. I don't need the product. Um, and within that day, they responded and they had um, credited me. So, and it, it went toward this order. <laughs> um, okay, so we're going to open this and we're going to see what the damage is. If For a quick rundown on what uh, FabFitFun is, it's a subscription box. It's $49.99 a quarter. Um, and they beware though that each quarter they also have two sales um, and that's what add-ons are it's a sale that comes with a subscription box so um, you end up if, you, if you, you you do end up sending more than $49.99 a quarter um, but the sales are incredible so I'm gonna go through this and show you so that's in case you didn't know um, and uh, I have a code below you can get $10 off your first subscription box if you become a member they give you a code that you can give out to people just to help attract customers so you can go ahead and use it if, if you decide to become a member from this video go ahead and use this code I think I get a credit I'm not sure there are some subscription boxes where you get a credit if people use your code some of them you don't get a credit if people use your code I think with FabFitFun I would get um, a credit as well I don't know but anyway it'll be below in the um, description box and also I will um, put below in the description box exactly what I paid for everything I did the research on um, the retail value if you weren't a member and didn't get these products on sale um, what you would have to pay um, the retail value so I will also put that in the description box below I will put yeah so I will also put that in the description box below I will put what I paid in the sale and the retail value of each product um, I can tell you right now that what I spent was three hundred and ninety five dollars but over $200 of this is Christmas presents. So um, uh, I spent $395 and the value that I spent on add-ons is $1,504. So I got all of this stuff for $1,100 cheaper than if I had bought them at retail value through the stores themselves. Okay, so let's get into the unboxing. Um, Living Proof, the Flex cold hairspray. I spent $9 on this. I'm pretty sure it retails for $26. It has excellent reviews. The Living Pro Proof products have excellent reviews. I think Jennifer Aniston is a co-owner of the company. There, um, oh, One thing that I did was I to weed out things that I, to, it was hard to pare down. It's really hard to get your cart down. Um, you want to just buy everything because it's such great prices. One thing that I did is I researched if the company wasn't cruelty free, I didn't buy it because I don't want to explore companies that aren't cruelty free anymore. I don't make enough money. It's, it's expensive to be entirely cruelty free in life. Oh, please excuse this mess behind me. I am doing Christmas present wrapping. Um, anyway, so uh, it's really expensive to be cruelty free in life, but uh, that was one way that I didn't, I, I was able to get things out of my cart fab fit fun. Not all the companies they pair, they work with are ethically perfect, so some of them aren't entirely cruelty free. Dr. Brandt, I was really excited to try the Dr. Brandt Microderm Abrasion. Turns out that the, that company is not cruelty free. Um, anyway, so I'm excited to try this. This hairspray has excellent reviews. People say it holds your hair without crunch and um, it's a cruelty free brand living proof. Okay, let's see. This is Living Proof. This is the multitasking styler. So far, this this box seems a little bit uh, crunched. I don't know if it's from the moisture, but uh, we'll see. Um, it doesn't matter because I got this for me and my husband. So I got this for me. I got this for me and my husband. Our favorite styling cream that we both used and loved. 
discontinued. So um, we're going to try this one out. This was also $9 and I believe it retails also for $26 just like the hairspray. Um, so I got this for him and me to try. Uh, you can use it for all kinds of things. It says tame, blow out, deconstruct. Oh, and then there's a uh, French below that. Tame, blow out, and deconstruct. Okay, so that's, um, that's exciting. I'm excited to try that. And I got a second one for my brother for Christmas. I just thought it would be fun to uh, get him a styling cream to try. So this is the Marrakesh Marrak Marrak Oil. This was $9, I believe. I'll confirm all these prices below, but I'll do what I remember. This was $9, I believe, and I think it's $30 retail. People rave about this stuff. Entirely cruelty-free. Again, everything I bought is cruelty-free. People rave about this stuff. I bought a second one. I um, am not sure what I'll do it with it, but I got to 100 subscribers, and my next video will be a 100 subscriber giveaway, so maybe it'll be included in that giveaway. Who knows? Um, but make sure to stay tuned for that giveaway. Um, okay, so there are two of these in this box. Um, yeah, here's the second one. What's this one? Oh, 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 oh. So this is the Immunicology. This is very expensive. This is, I'm actually going to, I wrote down all the prices. This I spent, um, this is the Night Protection Cream. This I spent $49 on and it retails for $250. So I got this for Christmas for my mother. Um, and it comes in, um, a plastic, but it's, it's safety sealed. So it's for a gift. So I'm not going to open it. I've heard amazing things about this company. Again, I, I weeded things out of my car if they weren't cruelty free. This is not only not cruelty free, they bragged so much on their website about all their sustainability practices. My mother is very much into that and she will be thrilled to try this for Christmas. I just broke the news to her that in all of this I've been learning about cruelty free stuff um, beyond what FabFitFun carries and I've learned that oil of Olay isn't cruelty free um, and uh, that that my mom was very, very sad to learn because she loves her Oil of Olay uh, products. So I bought this for her to um, use after she uses up her Oil of, oil of Olay. She's going to really, really be intrigued by this. I hope that she likes it. Um, some other people on YouTube, uh, one person, Cheryl Allen, uh, check out her channel. She's great. Um, she, uh, she recommended it. Um, and so I, I got this for my mom. I'm so excited to give it to her. Okay, what's next? Oh, here's a, I've, I've been, okay, so this has a little bit of water damage on the box. Um, you can't really see, but uh, this one's for me. It's okay, no big deal. Um, and it's a Karen G, but I, I've learned since that this is pronounced caring, K-A-R-Y-N-G. And the, the person's name is um, Dr. Karen Grossman. And so she did a little play on her names and it's pronounced caring. I've been saying Karen G, which is incorrect. This is a cruelty-free brand. Something that I like about her products too is she made sure she made sure that this is 3.4 ounces, 100 milliliters, which is the limit on what you can fly with. That makes me so happy. Um, so this is a replenishing cleanser. Um, gosh, I need to get a different camera. Um, it's, it's hard to read anyway, even, yeah. Um, okay, anyway, so this is a replenishing cleanser. Uh, I read good things about this. Um, I, Oh, I spent $7 and it was $25. I have my list here, but I don't want you guys to suffer through watching me find each product on my list. Um, but I will try to say it, but I will definitely list it below. Okay, next. This is so fun. This must have had a cap on it that fell off. This box This box went through some stuff to get to me. I It, it shipped and it was at my post office for like a week. They had it out for delivery several days. It, it went through some things. So I'm sure that this had a cap on it. It's also the Marrakesh. This one's the leave-in um, detangler, leave-in treatment and detangler, Ar argon and hemp oil therapy. I am a huge fan of argon oil. Um, I actually have pure argon oil that I use on my face. 
Um, so this one is just as coveted as their, this is the same line. And people just rave about this. I have not tried it yet. I will let you guys know once I use these things what I think. But um, people rave about this. So I also bought two of these. Yeah, it, it does come with a cap. So somewhere in here is another cap that goes on this guy. Okay, so I got two of those. I got, oh, I got two of the CBD relief creams. These are both gifts. I have a coworker who suffers from rheumatoid arthritis. So uh, it's by Nightingale. And this this was $19 and it retails for $70, $69.99, I think. Um, and uh, if people were saying really good things about this one. And you know, this this whole CBD stuff, I don't I haven't done too too much research on it, but I know that it can be really, really effective. I have people in my life who have used it and they just can't believe how much it works on a variety of ailments. And so I have a coworker who has RA. I'm gonna give this to her for Christmas. Um, and then I bought a second one for my husband and my adorable indecisive husband was like, oh, I don't know, I have to research. And I just went ahead and bought it anyway for him. So I have two of those. Um, so next thing, oh, they had this for free. I'm sure it's full of sugar. Um, actually, okay, it's V8. I assumed it would be full of sugar. It was, it was free, so I was like, okay, throw it in. I think if you buy more than $100 in your add-ons, there are these free things that you can also choose to throw in your cart. Um, total sugar is 10 grams, 45 calories. It's not as awful for you as I thought it would be. Anyway, it's free. It's free. Why not? Um, most food I just give to my husband and say, you can eat this. Okay, so this looks like it has a tiny bit of water damage on the package. That's okay. This is a DP Hue oil therapy, so more oil therapy. But um, I, for some reason, I really want to give one of these to one of my best friends. I just really want to give her a present. You know how a person will pop up in your head in your life and you just really want to send them a nice little surprise? Where did my scissors go? Um, <laughs> so I just, for some reason I saw it and I just really wanted to give it to her. I, I did do my research on it and it is, um, people rave about this as well. Really, really good reviews on Sephora and or Ulta. I can't remember which ones I read. It's DP Hue. I haven't tried this brand yet, so I also just really wanted to try this brand. I love oils. My hair loves oils. My skin loves oils. So I'm keeping one for myself, and I got one for that friend of mine. Um, and I'm just going to send it to her randomly out of the blue, not necessarily for Christmas. Um, I sometimes I like I like doing that. You know, you wait till after Christmas, and it's somebody you don't typically get a present for, and you just send them something. Um, Anyway, so that is uh, that. Really good reviews. This one, oh, here it is. I spent $11. I bought two. The retail is $35. It's amazing. Oh, it's dangerous. Um, I did better, though, this time than the fall edit sale. And the fall edit sale was my first uh, time having a sale. Um, anyway, so I got a derma roller. Cheryl Allen also suggested I get this for my mom. Um... But I, uh, I don't really see her buying into it. So if she doesn't want to, I will. <laughs> um, she'll, she'll probably look at me and say, Grace, it's too late for me. <laughs> I don't need some contraption like this. But, uh, it's a Dharma roller. I will open this one. Um, let's see if it feels, I mean, it feels plasticky. What else? I mean, that makes sense. I'm nervous to touch it. I want to keep it clean, but I think that you have to sterilize these anyway. Of course you have to sterilize them before you drag it along your face. Oh, that doesn't seem like it's going to hurt much at all. Maybe you really have to press. I don't know. I have to watch some demo videos on this. Um, so I got a Derma Roller. This was $9, and it retails for, I believe, $30. Again, double check below um, for the actual price. Uh, I don't want to break this, but I, I know that this will snap on. Anyway, okay. Uh, here's the other one of those. Okay, let's see. What is this? What is this? Oh, this is a foot cream. This is the Hey Honey Walk the Walk foot cream. This one also had amazing reviews, cruelty-free, free of all those chemically 
ingredients that we don't know whether or not they give us breast cancer. Uh, my, I have such dry skin, so I can't get enough of creams and whatnot. So this is Hey Honey. Um, there you can see it. Hey Honey, Walk the Walk. Uh, it's Pro... Propolis Foot and Heel Cream. Oh, I usually look everything up. I don't know what propolis is. Um, yeah, I, I just, let's, let's smell it. Let's do it. I get so dry. It smells pepperminty. It, oh, it looks so luxurious. I'm very excited to have a foot cream. I, every night I put uh, just my body cream on my feet. And this is probably just, this isn't my foot, but I'm going to put it on. Yes, I love this consistency. I don't like um, lotions and creams that have a watery base to them. I want it to be creamy. I want it to take a few minutes to uh, absorb into my skin. Otherwise, I don't feel like it's very nourishing. Okay, this video is going to be on the longer side. I'm sorry about that. Um, I also got, I love the Grown Alchemist stuff. I just, I love it. So they had a few things from Golden Al Grown Alchemist available. One was a matte moisturizer, and then I looked into that one, and I realized matte moisturizers or mattifying anything, I believe, are for normal to oilier skin, and I have dry skin. So that moisturizer just wasn't for me, so I didn't get that. But they had this body cream. This was $19, Grown Alchemist, and it uh, retails for $67. I have their um, exfoliant, which I love. I got a mask um, in the fall edit sale, a gel mask, which is really nice, and then I have another moisturizing cream, which is good. It, it feels like it works really well. My favorite thing is that exfoliant, though. It's so nice. It has a pretty strong smell to it. I'll do a review on Grown Alchemist stuff. Let's see. Let me just. Ooh, that smells. Um, it smells. It has a little bit of a medicinal smell to it. It's um, mandarin rosemary leaf. Has a little bit of a medicinal smell. We'll see how I like that. Um, there's something though like aromatherapy medicinal, not like, not like gross medicinal, medic, medicinal. It smells like it could cure a headache or something. It smells, smells good. No, it's growing on me. I like that. I do. I do. I would say I do like that. Um, this is the Corez body butter. I, um, really wanted to try this. People rave about Corez, I'm a little bit hesitant though because it's mulberry vanilla and I don't tend to go for sweet smells very much. Let's see, it must have a, yeah, it has a cover. Let's open that. And then try it out. Doesn't smell overwhelming. I'm getting kind of, I have a few smells going on me now, but, um, Let's try it over here. Yes, it's not watery. Oh, it's very light. It smells more like the mulberry, which I don't even know what mulberry smells like, but it smells more like a berry than vanilla. Oh, God, that's not overwhelming at all. I was worried about that. I like this. I do. I do like this. The Corez Body of Butter, $9, retails for $31. I like this. Okay. I do like that. <laughs> I would say so if I didn't. Oh, here's the other Living Proofs Multi-Styler Mask. I, I showed you guys that already. I had to bought two of those. Okay. Oh, this is something that is cruelty-free as well and had amazing reviews on Sephora and Ulta and sites like that. It's um, Skin Owl Neck Plus Sign. Um, and my sister and I were recently talking about, oh, I have my sweats on and you can see, my sister and I were recently talking about how, um, we, uh, we both have this issue going on with our neck 
our neck skin. And so she, uh, I, I bought her one of these also for Christmas. This has incredible reviews and it, um, I spent $14 and it retails for $68 and I bought two. So 14 times two, I spent $28. But one's going to my sister. Um, I, Oh, I'll do a review on the stuff I bought in fall separately. I'll do another video on that. Um, here's the other one. I'm so excited. I love I love giving people presents. I do. Um, oh, okay. So this is Murad. Uh, I really want to try Murad stuff, so I bought a couple. They're at our CVS's or, like, our, I don't know where you live, but CVS is like a Rite Aid or a... Or a Longs or a Walgreens or if you're in other countries, a Boots or a, you know, you know it's like, um, anyway, they're at CVS and they're behind a glass case. So they're like, like one expensive products that they carry. Anyway, so I've always wondered about them. But Murad, this is the cleanser. I, um, I have used Cetaphil since I needed to wash my face when I was like 12. And I just wanted to explore a couple of cleansers. So I got the Caring one and I got the Murad one. And I'll let you guys know what I think of those. Um, there's more. There's more. Um, I also figured why not? There was a shampoo and conditioner duo. This is the Nelson J. And, um, this was, uh, $12 for shampoo and conditioner. So I would spend that on shampoo and conditioner anyway. Retails for $40. And I was um, really debating between this and the chlorine, but I looked up chlorine. Chlorine is not cruelty free. So I went with the Nelson J. Okay. Living Proof Blowout. So I got the Living Proof Hairspray, Living Proof Blowout, and Living Proof Multi Styler. I have a couple other Living Proof products that I've been using from the Fall Edit Sale, and I will do a Living Proof review. I'll do a Living Proof review, I'll do a Grown Alchemist review. I am having so much fun with this stuff. Um, anyway, okay, so this one's... Oh, this is another freebie. I don't even really care to spend time showing you this, but I'll let you, I'll show you what they send you for free. This is a pesto sauce, and it is actually like a fairly good-sized jar. Um, Barilla pesto sauce. So I... It, this, I, I need, I'm 36, I need to be very careful and mindful of my weight, and so pesto sauce is not worth it for me to indulge in. I will probably let my husband eat that. Um, yeah, I have to pick what I want to indulge in. Um, oh, here is the other thing for my mother. It's that Immunology brand, and this is also extremely expensive, so I'm going to tell you. Um, this is the hyaluronic, I haven't said that, heard that pronounced, hyaluronic, I think, serum. And this was $39 and it retails for $195. So this and this are for my mom. And together, this would have been $445. <laughs> These two things. And I got them for $39 and $49. So I got them for $88. $88. That's kind of all she's getting. I'm getting her this, and then I'm getting her a journal that has a bunch of prompt questions, and I want her to fill it out so I can read about her well into my twilight years. Okay, so this is the bracelet that you can put a hair tie around. I have seen these, and I was just immediately excited that someone invented something, something like this because I almost always have a hair tie around my wrist and I don't even remember putting it on like it's like I blacked out and put a hair tie around my wrist and this would just make it look so much less little girl like I feel like I look oh you know something it doesn't feel terribly high quality um it, it still looks very nice but it honestly it feels very light it feels almost plasticky mm. I'm trying to see if it tells us what it's made of. Designed in the USA, made in China. Oh, I, I mean, I, I'm still gonna use it and love it, but I, this feels like it's made of tin. 
and it feels like it's made of tin and I'm trying to find the price oh hair tie I spent nine dollars and it retails for thirty five dollars I would never pay if I felt it in a store and and it was at they were asking thirty five dollars I would say you're funny you're cute I would actually say something a little more um, harsh but I'm, I try not to swear on my channel because I realize that um, a lot of mothers might watch me um, and have their children around anyway so that's what it looks like and it does it, I'm extremely thrilled to have something that makes my hair tie not look so hair tie -y, but it's really it, it this is poor quality that's surprising but it, I mean it doesn't look poor quality it doesn't look it just feels it uh, anyway okay um, Okay. Oh, this is more Mira. This is a moisturizer I will use eventually. Like I said, I've just seen Mira around and I wanted to use their stuff. Um, and so I got it. Uh, oh, and it's got one of those little applicators. I hadn't seen that before until I got a product last sale that had one too. And I guess that makes sense. You don't want to keep on putting your dirty fingers into your clean product that's supposed to nourish your face. Um, so I have seen really, really good reviews about this as well. I was debating between this and Skin Iceland, but um, ended up going with Murad uh, simply because Murad's just around. I've seen it around a lot more, and I've noticed a lot of the companies that are pairing with uh, FabFitFun are up and coming, up and coming high quality products. Um, and I think that might be Skin Iceland story. So I, I just wanted to try one that was a little more established um, in case I really liked it. And it's very available also. Um, so I just went with the mirror ad. There, that, there wasn't really much of a reason. Oh, this is just the Aloe Up. Um, Let's see if I can get that. Aloe Up For The Face Daily Moisturizer, and it's got SPF in it. It's the only one they had in the sale that was an SPF moisturizer, and so I needed it. I'm, I'm going to run out probably in the next few weeks of the one that I have, which is Oil of Olay, and they're not cruelty-free, so I'm going to try to stick with cruelty-free when and if I can afford it. Um, it's more expensive to be cruelty-free in life. That's so sad. Uh, one day, one day I can do it across the board. Anyway, okay, so this is cruelty free and it's um, a face moisturizer with an SPF. It had pretty good reviews. Um, I didn't see like rave reviews, but it had good reviews. Uh, people liked it. So there's that. That's for me and I needed it anyway. Um, check the price below for what I paid. Okay. Oh, there's more add-ons over here. This is the Grown Alchemist Eye Cream. I spent $21 on this and I think it retailed for $67. Check below to confirm. And this is for my brother um, for Christmas. I got him the hair styling mask and I got him this Grown Alchemist Eye Cream. I, when he opens it, I'm going to tell him he has to let me try it. I didn't get one for myself. It was $21 and I have an eye cream. Um, that I'm using and I have one on open and so I showed restraint. I was very proud because I love this grown alchemist stuff. I'm really loving it. Okay, so that's that. Let's get that back in the box. Um, I'll let you guys know what he thinks of that. Oh, here is um, Living Proof, More Living Proof, Overnight, Overnight Perfector Nightcap. So you Let's see what the use. Apply to damp or dry hair before bed from roots to ends. Comb through, leave in or wash out in the morning. Fast absorbing, pillow safe. Use as often as needed. Um, okay. Wake up to more vibrant, shiny, manageable hair that lasts up to five shampoos. Fascinating. Okay, I'm looking forward to trying this out. I've never tried anything out with that kind of description before. Cool. Um, oh, this is Wish Lip Scrub. I may keep this. It might be included in my 100 subscriber giveaway that I'm going to be doing. I'm not sure yet, but um, I will I will definitely curate my own little giveaway box that will be very fun. Oh, it doesn't have a protective cover. It has a subtle vanilla. Oh, it's an almond. Almonds. 
It has a subtle almondy smell. It smells nice. Um, and it's just a lip scrub. You scrub it on your lips, and then these people say that some people say that they eat it. I'd rather not like eat it because it would probably contain your skin. Um, but that's uh, no big deal, really. It is. It exfoliates brown sugar, raspberry seed, organic bamboo powder, bamboo powder, moisturizes. Organic shea butter, organic raspberry butter, organic aloe, renews, vitamin E extract, organic avocado oil. So I threw this in the cart thinking maybe it'll be in my giveaway. It was $5. It retails for $20. So I just tossed it in my cart. Um, there's that. And then, oh, here's the cap to this guy that I lost. Okay, so now we're on to Z-Box itself. So if you didn't purchase any of these other add-ons and you got your subscription box, this is all you would get. All you would get. It's filled with goodies. So there's more, and I can't believe this video is already half an hour long. Kudos to you if you're still with me. Okay. So the top looks like this. They get an artist to design every box. Um, I'm really glad it's not water damaged because they're very reusable. Um, it comes with, every time it comes with a magazine and some coupons, coupons on top. So there is a, oh, here's a $10 off gift card to join FabFitFun. It has a little code I'm covering. Um, maybe I'll give this to a friend, I don't know, stocking with, with their Christmas gift or something. Here's a HelloFresh $60 gift card. Last time it was a $50 gift card. They're really trying to entice you. I just don't see myself ever doing a food subscription for meals. I don't know. I don't know. Um, wow. They're really trying to get me, though. Um, and then here's the booklet. It features Brooke Burke this quarter. Um, and then inside, there are some articles on how to use what comes in the box, along with little descriptors, the descriptors um, and the prices for each item in the box. So if you're a select member and you pay yearly, you get a little bit more freedom about how you can refine what comes in your box. So I am a select member, which means I paid for the whole year, and um, I was able to choose most of this. So here is the Mark and Graham personalized throw. This is a throw blanket. It's very soft. Um, it is, we could choose between these two colors. So there's gray and there's the camel color. And it retails for $49. I chose the gray. Um, the tip here says hand wash cold and lay flat to dry. I don't know that I'm down for that. So I might gift this. Um, it's soft. I have a couple of throw blankets. Um, all right, I'll open it. <clears throat> I'll open it and then I'll roll it back up if I'm going to gift it. Um, you know, that bit fun's awesome. They aren't always completely on point with their products. This is, they're, they're calling this a throw. It's a little, it's a little small and it's a little thin. Uh, it's actually almost more of a shawl and I've seen people actually mistake this for a scarf in their unboxings, just completely mis mistake it for a scarf, and um, they are, but they are calling it a throw blanket. Um, it's, it's, it has a weird smell. Um, it's okay. You know, I'm not terribly impressed with it. It's nice. It's a nice little throw blanket. I'm going to be completely honest about what my opinions are. You know, I'm not terribly impressed with FabFitFun's jewelry either. Um, the next thing I will show you is um, this Oribe. I'm going to talk a little bit about jewelry soon. Um, this is this Oribe dry shampoo. This is either like golden or they are just bribing people to rave about them. People are raving about Oribe products. And so this is it. This is the dry shampoo. I'm excited to try it out. I It's my first real dry shampoo. I have a little sampler that I've been testing out recently, but I'd like to start 
straightening my hair and playing with my hair and curling my hair. I have just curly hair and I usually just run product through it and let it be curly, which, um, you know, it, I love it, but I've decided to try to play with my hair a little bit more, so I'm excited to use this. So for this one, you could choose between this dry shampoo, you can choose between this jewelry caddy, and you can choose, or you could have chosen this um, necklace, this circle necklace. So this is where I'm going to talk a little bit about that. So the Oribe dry shampoo is 45, worth $44. The jewelry portfolio, they called it, is $48. And this necklace was $49. So the thing that bothers me about the jewelry is this necklace that they say is worth $49, that better be sterling silver, at least. This is silver plated brass which is really disappointing to me. Um, and, it, and I've seen it in unboxings. It's pretty, it looks nice, but it's silver plated brass and you're gonna sell it, you're gonna sell it for $49. So, you know, there are some things, the fact that fun isn't always perfect, but they're amazing. They do a really, really good job. Um, but you know, they're not, never 100% on point. Um, you can't be, you just can't be uh, in life, right? So, but yeah, I, I love that fit fun. I'm going to be a member for a long time, I think. Okay, so the next thing is this um, Jade Roller. They're super popular. Um, it's funny because Cosbox, I'm also a member of Cosbox, and spoiler, there's a Jade Roller in their winter box as well. Um, so I'm going to choose the one that I like better and keep it. <laughs> And then I'm going to gift the other one, just a surprise gift to a friend like I was talking about earlier, sending them something out of the blue after the holidays are over. Um, so this is it. It seems really nice quality. Let's see a little bit more about it. So for this, you could have chosen the Jade Roller, these socks, or this um, palette. I don't wear a lot of makeup other than lip color and mascara, so uh, palette would kind of sit and collect dust in my home. Um, and then if you are a select member like I am, you can say, oh, I'd also like this one too. I'll pay an extra $10 to receive that item. So what I did is I really liked these over-the-knee socks, so I paid the extra $10 and I have them here, so I will show you these as well. Um, so the Jade Rollers retail value is $45, the Socks retail value is $24, and this palette, which is pure Be Your Selfie palette, it looks like really gorgeous nude colors, um, is worth $36. Um, so I, uh, this, let's see, okay, this Jade Roller, Sherry Matthews Acupuncture Jade Stone Roller, which I don't know why it's called acupuncture. It's no wonder this anti-aging beauty tool has been used by empresses for centuries. The Jade Roller helps stimulate chi energy um, and promotes a feeling of facial relaxation. And, you know, it really does. I have a... Um, crystal sphere in my office at work and I will just pick it up and I will roll it on my face just because they seem to the stones just seem to retain cold they seem to run about 10 degrees cooler than the air temperature and it feels just incredibly soothing I I I do that regularly in my office, so this feels really nice. I have um, been seeing this and thinking, oh, it'd be really cool to stumble on one of those, but I've never cared to pay for it, but now I have one. Um, so it's really, really, it feels really, really good, it does. Um, and it can help with circulation and puffiness under the eyes. Okay, here are the socks. So I paid an extra $10 to also receive these socks. They are $24 value. They feel nice. Let's see. Yeah, they feel nice. Um, they're long, they look warm. Let's see what the material is. Equally cute and cozy, these socks are made from recycled yarn to keep you warm on even the coldest of nights. Recycled yarn. Doesn't say what the material is. Okay, that's fine. Doesn't say what the material is, but they feel very nice. The foot looks really big on them, but that's okay. Um, yeah, so they, they feel soft. They feel nice. I like them. I do. Okay. It's always quite a cleanup process after opening all this stuff. Um, okay, so here is a uh, Moroccan Gold Series hair mask. And uh, I now have like four or five hair masks on deck. So I'm set for 2019 for hair masks. Um, okay, so this one... 
is up here. And you could have, so here's the hair mask, and you could have chosen this, or you, some, sorry about the texting, um, you could have chosen this, or you could have chosen these, uh, this bear paw headband and glove set. It doesn't get cold enough where I live to care to get something like that, so I went with the hair mask, um, and, um, the hair mask is worth $49. The bear paw set was $45. Uh, Bear Paw is a good brand. I do like Bear Paw. But um, anyway, so here is the treatment mask, the hair mask. Let's see what it smells like. It doesn't come with a protective cover. Oh, wait, no, it might. It's just stuck up here, I think. Yeah, it does come with a protective cover, but it got stuck in the lid, which is a recurrent problem. It smells good. It smells subtle. And it smells like an expensive spa. I like the smell. I don't like overwhelming scents. So, that's good. Um, I've heard good things about that brand, too. This is essential oils. So, with the essential oils, you could have chosen between these or this Merci Anthropology body cream. I have plenty of body creams, and this Merci Anthropology body cream is uh, coconut sugar. I don't tend to go for the sweeter smells. Like I said, I was a little bit nervous about mulberry vanilla scent, which I ended up liking this in case you missed that part earlier. Um, so uh, I don't like the sweeter scents. This is an Anthropology crossed with a Merci Company and Oh, Mercy and Company, uh, Sea Whip Body Cream and Coconut Sugar, and it was worth $24. It is worth $24. I didn't get that. I got these um, essential oils, which I actually haven't really been into essential oils. Oh, this side. You're welcome. Elevate is the company. And this actually interested me. I'm not really a diffuser per person, but this interested me, excuse the texting, um, because this, this, sold itself more for the medicinal value than the, the diffuser scent. Um, it said that um, way of will elevate essential oil set sweet orange and eucalyptus oil. So there's one eucalyptus and one sweet orange. It's not a combination scent. So there's this sweet orange one and then the other one in here is eucalyptus and they look like this. And unlike typical essential oils, these oils can be applied directly onto the skin, which I think other essential oils, you have to dilute them somehow in order to apply them onto the skin or else they're too, they can be really harsh. Um, and so eucalyptus helps with sore muscles and cold symptoms, while sweet orange eases stomach cramps and headaches. So I thought that that was actually kind of interesting. I love natural medicine. I really do. Just like I was talking about the CBD relief cream that I bought for a couple of people in my life. Um, so that is the essential oils. And there's more. So these are body sliders. Um, so Brooke Burke, like I said, she's featured in this quarter's magazine. Last quarter was Christina Applegate, who I think is tons of fun. So these are exercise discs, and you put them on the full floor. You put your feet on them, and you do a plank kind of position, and then you can move your feet around and really get a full body workout. It looked really fun. Um, so here is what you could have chosen from. You could have gotten this lipstick. You could have gotten, if you were lucky, these coasters, but they sold out really quickly, and I saw on the community forum on the FabFitFun website that the reason for that was that some of uh, their product, I think, had been damaged, so they actually had far fewer of them to give out um, than they expected. So those sold out really quickly, and then these are the body sliders, and there are, on the FabFitFun website, if you're a member, you log in, there are also videos, it's called FabFitFun TV, so there are videos um, you can follow with Brooke Burke using these and get your ex exercise in, and I talked about it in my one of my other videos, I really, really want to get an exercise routine in, and I'm very much looking forward to that. If you are into something like this, and you're like, oh, I, I would like something like that, I've heard that furniture sliders can do the same thing and I bet you dollars to donuts that if you Google furniture slider workout or you YouTube search furniture slider workout and you go grab yourself some furniture sliders, you can do the same thing. You don't have to get something like this. So if you want to try something like this out but you're, you've are you missed the boat on this box, that's a little tip for you. So these are worth $18, the coasters were worth $18 and the lipstick was worth $26. 
Um, and then, so those were the customizable items. And then there are three things in the box that everyone just got. Um, so there's this Ahava hydration cream mask. I'm not sure if it's for your face or your hair. I will let you know shortly. Um, Infuse and nourish thirsty skin with this active hydrating mask. So it's for your face. A rich, creamy texture softens and smooths skin, providing intense hydration and comfort. Maybe it's not just for your face. Apply once or twice a week, rinse after three to five minutes, or leave all night. I don't know. I'm confused. I don't know if this is for my face or for my whole body. And if it's for my whole body, I'd rinse it off. That's um, Okay, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Ahava FabFitFun seems to sell Ahava brands all over the place. So, oh my gosh, it's my sister. Um, <laughs> uh, they FabFitFun seems to sell Ahava regularly. So I haven't tried anything yet of theirs because they typically seem to sell hand creams. There's no protective seal, so it's just open. Smells fine. I'm confused by this because I don't know if it's supposed to be on my body, my whole body, or just my face. I'm running out of places to try things. Let's see. It feels nice. It's, it seems very hydrating. I don't understand the rinse off or leave on option. Um, but I, I mean, I, I love, I get very dry skin. I woke up when I was 13 with eczema all over my body. And ever since then, I have been religiously putting on body cream and moisturizer. So, um, I'll use it. I'm confused by it though. Okay. And it smells good. It smells good. Um, okay. So this is by Thrive Cosmetics and cause is spelled C-A-U-S-E Cosmetics. So I read a little bit about this company and they do, um, a lot to empower women. I, I'm not exactly sure, but they pride themselves on the work they do for the empowerment of women, and that is a huge plus with me. Uh, beauty with a purpose. Here we go. For every product you purchase, we donate one to a woman in need. That's cool. Also, a tip. I just realized I was wondering what to do with a lot of my half-used products, and take them to a women's shelter where poor abused women are going to escape their lives with their abusers and give them something to use to help them feel good about themselves. It's such a good idea. I got that idea from Tati. She's a huge YouTuber. Um, and that's what she does with her products. Also, um, rehab facilities. Those people, you know, they show up there, they're desperate to get sober, and they show up, they've packed, hammered, and they show up with, you know, four t-shirts, no underpants, and no deodorant, and so if you donate your products to those places too, or donate to those places, those people need help. Um, okay, so anyway, digressing. This video is already very long. So this is a highlighter stick, and so it looks like this, and I think it yeah, it, it's like a pencil goes up and down. If you twist it, you don't have to sharpen it. And you it's one of those things you put here or on your brow bone or right here. I don't typically use a lot, a lot of makeup, but I do sometimes use highlighter. So that's nice. And um, I love the cause. I love the cause. Anything that has a cause associated to it, I'm a sucker for. It. The product can be like, okay. And I'm just like, yes. Uh, okay, and then the last thing, the last thing, we're almost done, guys. Um, is these black eye masks with, again, a hyaluronic acid, and they're those little things that go under your eyes, and you leave them on, and then you take them off, and then you're supposed to have amazing under eyes. Um, so, oh, I haven't said what these things were worth. So the Thrive, um, this highlighter is $24.00 infused with macadamia and meadow foam oil. This meadow foam oil, that's a new one. The silky champagne eye brightener instantly highlights and brightens your eyes. Um, and then the, uh -huh, the confusing Ahava hydration cream mask. Maybe this tells me more. Enriched with mineral spring water, shea butter, and vitamin E, this rich creamy mask often softens and smooths the skin while providing intense hydration and comfort. $33. Um, 
Use it as a three minute hydration boost or as an overnight sleeping mask. So I think it's for your face. <laughs> I think that it doesn't really say anywhere on the bottle, but I think it's for your face. Which, okay. Anyway, okay, and then this, so they look like these. $29, and there are five of them. Black hydrogel eye mask with hyaluronic acid. Is your under eye area puffy or swollen? Detox and depuff with this activated charcoal eye mask for a refreshed look. Um, okay, now I'm going to try to get to the bottom of this Ahava thing because there are tons of descriptors and with ideas about how to use each thing that comes in the box. Here's a little spread on book Brooke Burke, who is responsible for the body sliders. Um, yeah, uh, here's more, there's travel tips. Yeah, anyway, so there's a, there's a lot of good stuff in here to help you figure out your products. So there will probably some, be something in there to help me figure this out, and I'm sure it's going to be great. Well, I don't know. I'm not sure it's going to be great. I'll let you know if it's great. Um, okay, that's about it, you guys. Um, thanks for just toughing this out with me. If you have any questions about anything, please ask me below. I do, you know, try to move through these things, and sometimes I might leave something out, and I actually already know the answer, and I just didn't happen to say it. Thank you for joining me. Like, comment, subscribe, and, um, yeah, I'd love to get to know you. All right, bye.